Namaste, you're on The Nation at 5. I'm Anand Narsimhan and we begin with the big news coming through. It's a follow-through of our story on Friday which talked about that it was not just Jamtara, the entire Simanchar belt where this Jumma holiday was being practiced against the norms as listed by the state government and uh, in violation of the law itself that was said. Uh, said. And the fact is it, was, it had become an unwritten law and even schools that were not designated as Urdu schools had been following this Jumma holiday practice much against uh, the wishes of not just the teachers but also a lot of the students. Now following this, the state government in Bihar said that they are uh, apprised of the matter and that they have put out a sent out queries to get a report, a detailed report on the reality on ground and as to how this was being practiced. What we gave you information at CNN News 18 was that about almost 500 schools uh, across multiple regions in Simanchal which were following this practice and how it had become an unwritten law or code was a bigger question. Now, we've got, we have accessed far more details in this entire aspect, these Friday holidays that were froze, a contravention of law, like I said. Now, after our report, the Bihar and Jharkhand governments have said that they are taking swift action. But the larger question is, they have still not, Jharkhand issued a notice that you have to get back to the status quo, get back to the original format of Sunday holidays till the time the report is sought and a particular policy is put in place. But in Bihar, no such notification so far has been issued too. Let's listen into what the Deputy Chief Minister had to say. मैं गया था किशनगंज और सिमांचल रीजन में मैं घूम के आया वहाँ पे लगभग स्कूल्स अराउंड मोर देन 500 स्कूल्स इसके लिए मैंने मैं बता रहा हूँ ना कि जो प्रशास प्रशासी विभाग है शिक्षा विभाग है और शिक्षा विभाग के अपने मापदंड हैं कि छुट्टियाँ कब होगी साप्ताहिक छुट्टी कब होगी ये सारे चीज पूर्व से तय है और माने शिक्षा मंत्री ने इन सारे चीजों को जांच का निर्देश भी दिया है। बट सर ये वर्बल ऑर्डर दिया गया है कोई रिटेन नोटिस या फिर ऑर्डर नहीं। तो ये देखिए सरकार किस के अपने नियम है और नियमों से हमारा शासन और प्रशासन चलता है। लिखित निर्देश क्यों नहीं दिया? देखिए सरकार की ओर से कोई सरकार की ओर से तो अस्पष्ट नि� पर तैयार की छुट्टी होगी ये तो शिक्षा विभाग इस सारे मामले को देख तो रिपोर्ट आने के बाद हम एक्सपेक्ट कर रहे हैं कि कार्रवाई होगी जो इसी तौर पर अगर कोई सरकार के नियम के जो नियम निदेशित है उसके खिलाफ अगर कोई काम होगा तो स्वाभाविक है कि सरकार आवश्यक कार्रवाई करेगी अभी विस्तृत रिपोर्ट आई नहीं है वैसे हमने जो पूछा था तो उन लोगों ने बताया कि ये इस तरह की कार्रवाई पिछले कई दशकों से चल रही है लंबे समय से चल रही है तो हमने इसीलिए कहा है कि आप इसकी विस्तृत मतलब पड़ताल कर लीजिए जांच कर लीजिए कि ये कब से हो रही है और किस परिपेक्ष में हो रही है और उसका विस्तृत प्रतिवेदन दीजिए तब हम लोग उस पर जो नियम संगत निर्णय होगा वो लेंगे Now we've got uh, we've got more news coming through, and this is uh, something which is startling, ladies and gentlemen. CNN News 18 has accessed uh, how this practice has been running for years, but there were orders from the highest authorities which are now being violated. These orders are dated 2012, and if my memory serves me right, that was also a time when the JDU was in power in Bihar. This was issued by the former governor Devanand Kamar. And the directive is to employees of the state mentions a special break of two hours for Juma prayers. However, despite this, the Friday off continued. Now, this is what it says. Shukruwar ke din Jumme namaz hetu vishesh anumati pradhan kiye jane ke sambandh mein Muslim sarkari sevakon ki British kaal se hi shukruwar ke din dopeer mein Jumme ki namaz masjidon ke samoi group mein adha karne hetu karyaale mein anuspastit rehne ki vishesh anumati prapt hai. Ukt anubhuze anumati avdhi parivartan hetu the... जन शिकायत के माध्यम से अनुरोध प्राप्त हुए हैं सो वॉट दे हैव टर्न अराउंड एंड सेट मुस्लिम सरकारी सेवक प्रत्येक शुक्रवार साढ़े बारह से ढाई बजे तक अवधि पर उपभोग जुम्मा की नमाज अदा करने हेतु कर सकेंगे क्योंकि इस अवधि में भोजनावकाश की अवधि भी निर्धारित है ऐसे में सरकारी सेवकों से अलग भोजनावकाश अनुमान्य नहीं होगा शिक्षा संस्थानों एवं गैर सरकारी संस्थानों में जुम्मे की नमाज हेतु इस प्रकार के विदेश अनुमति संबंधित संस्थानों के सक्षम प्राधिकारों द्वारा दिया जा सकेगा सो दिस इज वॉट हैज बीन सेट 
clearly that even in educational institutions, it's not about an off on Fridays or Jumma, but it is a special provision of a longer extended lunch break from 12.30 to 2.30, where you can perform the prayers and also have your lunch and come back to work or come back to school. So this is a 2012 order dated the 20th of July 2012. And it is issued in Patna, Bihar Sarkar, Samanya Prashasan Vibhag, and that it is Bihar Rajapal ke Adesh se, signed by the governor. So this is the this is the order that is issued in Bihar. But for the last 10 years, there has there's been a brazen violation and disregard to this very order. So this is not a fresh issue. This has been raised in the past. And this is what has said that there will be no holiday on Friday. Saurabh is joining us with more details on this, Saurabh. So this order clearly states that even educational institutions, they can work with this relaxation of two hours, 12.30 to 2.30, which is a lunch come prayer break. Yes, Anand. And before that, I would like to give you the latest update in this uh, issue. Uh, I just talked to DEO, uh, District Education Officer of Purnia. He gave me the mm. figures which are startling. He gave me the figure of 9 blocks uh, out of 14 blocks. And he said that there were 325 schools alone in Purnia which uh, are closed on Fridays. So this number of 500 is absolutely going to touch uh, uh, around thousand if you uh, uh, we may uh, if we say so uh, this is the latest update from one district the report uh, is getting ready all the district uh, uh, of the Simanchal region are they are preparing the report of the schools now if we talk right. about particularly about this notice which came in 2012 uh, uh, see there is a, a larger uh, you know uh, uh, picture about it because uh, the, the schools that were uh, opened in 1900s, like uh, in, in the in the 19th century, uh, 1901, well, 1900. Sort of just wait with me. I have I have Sunil Singh of the JDU with us. Sunil Singh ji, namaste. This is Anand Narsiman. We are speaking after a while. Trust well, all is well at your end. Let me ask you. But uh, what is happening in Bihar, sir? 325 schools alone in Purnia, and this is only nine out of the 14 blocks that we've got the update. More than 500 schools in the Simanchal region are, fried, are following this Friday off or Jumma, Jumma ke din chutti policy in government schools against an order which was issued in 2012 under the JDU government by the governor then saying that Friday you will have a two-hour break for prayer and lunch. Nothing else, no holiday. I'm just taking this for specific that it is government is committed to the social and communal harmony in the state. And moreover, the Nitish government is too concerned with the education of the kids. So in a few places, the Simanchal area of Bihar, the particular community are more in number, they are in majority. And even on the Friday, their kids can't go to school. Their, their, their kids can't go to school because of their own difficulties. So if the schooling is on Sunday and not on Friday, how does it matter? Our purpose is that kids should get educated. And that is all. There is no constitutional obligation to us. No, and but but on what? On but there is no official order regarding the same. These schools are not even Urdu designated schools. These are government schools, and the government order under the JDU government ten years ago Hello? says very clearly, no holiday on Friday. It's just an extended break that you will get twelve thirty to two thirty. So on whose orders and whose permission is this being allowed, sir? For the administration to decide, I'm not an inquiring officer that I can tell you about all these things. It's for the government to take the call. So where was the order? Who did not follow the order? It's not our lookout. Our lookout is one thing that if we say, if we no, it is your lookout because you are in power, sir. You, you, because you are in power, it is your lookout that is violation of the of the order. It is the JDU's lookout, and the JDU so far has not even issued an order which says that you revert back to Sunday holiday immediately. That's the standard operating procedure until and, and and unless you get a specific so sure leeway. Because that's, so what, sure that, that's what the Bihar Education Act says and that's what this notice also says. This is they, this is issued by the governor and at that time the uh, Naveen Chandra Jha is, has signed this. Bihar Rajapal ke Adesh se signed 27, 2012, which very clearly says ki dhai vajay se do var, uh, bar, saade bara vajay se dhai vajay tak ka beech ka aapko ye milega break to, to have your lunch and to offer the Jumma Namaz. And this applies to Shiksha Sansthan also and Ghair Sarkari Sansthanon ke, ke liye bhi.